Well, certainly this individual is being introduced right now. Rick Martell! Rick Martell with a high five there to his tag team partner at WrestleMania there on the outside of the squared circle, Tito Santana. That brings up a question. What gives Chico the right to be outside that ring, McMahon? He's not a licensed manager. You got me on that, Jess. I mean, who did he talk to? Well, maybe a little far us apart. Not for keep an eye. Team partner. I, I mean, if I was Iron Mike Sharp, that would be a distraction because you never know what Chico's going to do outside the ring. I don't think you'll see any outside interference, Jeffrey. You really believe that if Martel got in extreme trouble in this matchup, Chico wouldn't lend a hand? Well, I don't think go so far as to say that. Certainly, that's Tito, by the way, not Chico. And certainly Martel and Santana, perhaps better known as Strike Force, are going to have their hands full in approximately a week at WrestleMania when they square off against the Brain Busters. And I'm told now that the Brain Busters are standing by for a comment. Never lost for words, the Brain Busters. Rick Martel, you're looking as good as you ever did. Tito Santana standing right there. But at WrestleMania 5, it's tag team action, not one-on-one. -on -one. The success you're enjoying is short-lived. WrestleMania 5 is our night to shine. I assure you. Nice maneuver by Martel. The drop kick that lands on Iron Mike. And an arm drag takedown, and indeed, Rick Martel is really shining. Well, I'll tell you, I've never seen Martel as polished as he's been. You know, maybe the long layoff did him some good. Iron Mike a bit frustrated. But again, the Brain Busters raise a very interesting point as to whether or not Santana and Martel will be able to function together as a unit collectively as they used to be, Jesse. Well, that's a great, great point, McMahon, because the Brain Busters are like precision machinery. They are on right now in their tag team wrestling. And I have to believe that Martel and Santana, even though they were a great combination before, has got to be slightly rusty. Great fought by Martel, and ooh, a very little Frank Mr. Drake to connect. Rick Martel with an arm drag takedown into the arm bar. Martel and Santana going their separate ways after Martel was injured some time ago. And of course, thus far, Rick Martel making a tremendous comeback as an individual competitor. But nonetheless, everyone, Jesse, looking forward to the reuniting of Strike Force at WrestleMania. I'm not looking that forward to it. Come on, Jess. Although I am looking forward to the matchup because I think it's going to be a tremendous matchup, and I give the advantage to the Brain Busters at WrestleMania. Why? Like I said, I think Martel and Santana are going to be a bit rusty. They should have been a tag team here, not individual competition. Perhaps, Jesse, but just remember one thing. Martel and Santana are former tag team champions of the World Wrestling Federation. Exactly as you said, former. Former don't make it. That's yesterday. Martel in control here. Has the legs of Iron Mike trying to get him over for the Boston crowd. He's, too, coming up he's right too, too far from the ropes to get to him. Rick Martel jumping for joy. Rick Martel and Tito Santana, Strike Force, reuniting at WrestleMania. Let's go back, Jeff. Here you see Iron Mike missing with the big clothesline. Martel with a beautiful drop kick right on the chin, and then flipping Iron Mike over and getting a submission with the Boston Crab. Let's take you now, ladies and gentlemen, to a special World Wrestling Federation update. 